गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स लेट इज प्रोसीड आर चैप्टर लाइट एंड टूडे वी विल डिस्कस स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ आई प्रीवियस क्लास जस्ट वी हैव स्टार्टेड अ आई आई इज अ वेरी सेंसिटिव ऑर्गन विच इज बल्जिंग आउटवर्ड्स विच यूज लाइट टू मेक ऑल द थिंग्स विजिबल टू अस we have also discussed the sclera white portion of the eye and choroid just beside the sclera which is of consist of dark pigment and it absorbs extra amount of light when which is not required in the formation of image so after that let's start it we are seeing an eyeball black color ball is there so that ball is known as cornea light does not passes from sclera that is of white portion light always passes from cornea so cornea allow the light to enter inside the eye just beside the cornea there is a watery fluid that is known as aqueous humor aqueous humor if you will see in any others eyes always we find out that it is one fluid is there or water is present inside the eye that is known as aqueous humor what is the work for the aqueous humor now you see i am standing and teaching you if someone has came from right hand side of the me and then ask may i come in then what i have to turn and then say who is that and then i'll allow but that work of aqueous humor is it make flexible to the inside organ of the eye and very easily we are standing and from here only we can see who has came who is in this direction who is there all 180 degree we will see so it makes flexible to the inside organ of a eye just beside this you will see a disc shaped structure or it is made up of muscles is known as iris this is iris iris is a disc shaped structure which consists colored pigment students you have seen that um, somebody whose eyes looks black somebody whose eyes looks brown what is the reason behind that we all are human being why some eyes are brown some eyes are uh, black some eyes are even dark bluish type so iris consist a dark color pigment that pigment only gives color to the eyes and we see black color or brown color between this iris there is an opening just see this this opening is known as pupil in a ball also you will see there is one big ball cornea and inside that there is one small black ball that is that is only pupil and finally this pupil only allow the light to get inside the eye beside this pupil there is a lens that is convex lens crystalline lens which is known as convex lens and just beside the lens there is a jelly like fluid why i am saying jelly like fluid because if you just in put jelly in any plate or anywhere you will see that it will not float or it will not flow it is neither uh, hard solid or not liquid that will flow so that jelly like fluid is present just beside the convex convex lens that is known as vitreous humor this 
vitreous humor maintains structure of eye and so it gives the shape of eye beside the vitreous humor there is a screen of eye known as retina from camera you have taken photograph so we now now the digital camera has came beforehand what we are doing just we are putting a reel inside the camera a photographic film inside the camera and in that that photographic film take the photos and we are seeing that same way our eyes is also camera that photographic film or that reel that screen is acting that is retina retina is made up of more than million number of cells that cells as are known as photoreceptors means photo light receptors by receiving the light it becomes activate and start functioning that's why you will see when we sleep we close our eyes we cannot see anything because that cells does not become active so retina is made up of photoreceptor cells that photoreceptor cells are in two forms rods that is cylindrical cells and cones that is conical cell rods is responsible for brightness we see there is more light there is less light there is dark there is bright how we can able to see who is responsible for that who is showing that that is the rod cell and cone cell is responsible for showing color we are seeing this thing is of red color this is white color this is black color this one is red color so how we are seeing see this one is of brown color or chocolate color you can say so who is responsible for that how the brain is seeing this is this color so that is responsibility of cone cell so retina is made up of photoreceptor cell and that number of cell is more than millions this cell consists two types rods and cones rods for brightness cones for color and when this cell receives light it takes the picture changes into electrical signal and that signal is sent to the brain by optic nerve optic nerve and this optic nerve send the electrical signal to brain brain is the principal part and in the brain even there are many subordinate bodies as in the school you are seeing that is one main body is principal's body and then principal whatever suppose something has came from cbsc principal is sending seeing first which subject okay english then see given english department hindi hindi department respectively same way here also there are many subordinate bodies in the brain and brain receiving that electrical signal and give response to that subordinate body and then that part is telling us yes we are seeing this thing we are seeing this is black color we are seeing this is red color so this is the structure of i you see the video draw the structure write the parts and its functions and next class we will discuss the working of i okay